Hey there, so I want to show you the, the Chromebook Canvas. It's like a whiteboard. Now, with the Chromebook Canvas, what's really important is you're going to need a stylus. And by default, the newer Chromebooks come with a stylus. This model does. Will all the models have that? No, I cannot promise you this. It all depends on the contract. So for this particular model, I have a stylus. And I wanted to show you the app piece. Now, you will notice in my tray that I have the Canvas Palette um, app already there but to find if just in case you don't have it you can go to your app station and select it once it loads it's just that now you're gonna see that I've been playing with this I love this little little feature because then I can process out um, with images um, through sketch noting or um, just drawing it out or I'm gonna show you some fun ways to do some mind mapping if you need to all right so I'm gonna start with a new one and what's really nice is you do have all these options here on the left so you have the color palette, you can change the colors, you have the ability to change the size or the transparency of the, the writing tool. And then you have different writing tools from a pencil. And I'm just going to do a quick draw with this just so you can see what it looks like. Uh, a pen, a marker, and a crayon. So you can see the difference between the four writing tools. And of course, and then you do have the eraser, so if you needed to erase something, you could. Um, then what's really nice is you can just create as many um, canvases as, as you want. So I can just start over. No worries, I'm just gonna trash it at, at a later time. So teacher asks a true false question, the students can respond. It's, let me go to my marker. It's true, and I'm going to show the teacher it's true, All right? Or I'm going to start a new one, and the idea here is that it's so simple, just creating new ones. I can demonstrate my understanding of learning as a student by writing it out. So I'm going to focus on a question, right? And then I can go in and answer the question based off of the requirements of the instruction. And so I know that it's 30. Great. Now I want to change my color and highlight some areas that allows me to demonstrate my difference, okay, or my learning, my understanding. Again, as an instructional standard for uh, te technology, knowledge construction is critical. That's one of our seven standards. Okay. So what's really nice about this is I can do a couple things. I can save the image, and when I click Save Image, it's going to allow me to bring it up. And what's really nice is it automatically saves it right into my Google Drive as my, um, because I'm logged into the device. And I'm going to say Math Q1. And when I click Save, I'm going to show you what that looks like in my drive. So I'm going to go back to my drive. We'll let it load. You can see that it's it's loading right now. And once it finishes loading, you should see that Math Q1 come into the drive. So I'm going to do a quick refresh. And so the, what's nice about this is that I can then take this screenshot, this image, drop it into my Google Classroom, my Schoology Classroom, and it demonstrates my understanding of learning for the teacher. And then as I open it up, there's my Math Q1. I now have this image, uh, and again, I can use it however I need to. All right, so that is Canvas by default on Google Chromebooks. Thanks.